talked before about having content pillars in your content strategy. And then I get questions about, well, what do you mean by that? What is a content pillar and why do I need that? And very simply, a content pillar is another word for having content categories. These categories are basically different titles or headings or themes that you build content around for your business. Now, as artists and makers, we have some very obvious content pillars, content categories. And of course, that is going to be our work. That is one type of content, but it's only one pillar, one category. We could break that down further and we want to be thinking about what do our customers want to see from us? How are they going to get to know us as an artist? How are they going to get to know us as a maker? How are they going to get to know our product? What do they need to know to help them buy our product? Do they need to know the stories behind the pieces, the concept? Do they need to know how the piece is made? Is that important? How are our customers going to use our products? Why would our customers be buying our products? Who is our product for? And I want you to start to build themes, titles, categories around these things. What different types of content pillars might you need as an artist maker?